I'm, nervous. I'm definitely the boyfriend behind the camera. <sighs> Look at her. I want you to show me how to get to know someone like you. Someone like you. Hey guys, it's Deanna and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So for this week's video, I figured it would be best to film a get to know me tag. I haven't made a video like this in a really long time. I think like two or three years ago, I filmed a 50 facts about me video, but I don't even know what I said in that video and it's probably not even true currently. So I think before I start filming weekly content, it's a good idea for you guys to have more insight about me and to get to know me on a personal level besides just what you see on Instagram. Oh, go, go. This is um, my studio <laughs> where I film videos. It's very professional. We're gonna film an updated get to know me video and I have a bunch of questions on my phone, so here we go. First question asks, how do I drink my tea? I hate tea, so I drink my coffee with caramel and cream and sugar and only ice. So if anyone has a hot coffee that they love, please comment down below because it's freezing out. I look like a crazy person still drinking iced coffee in like 20 degree weather. So please comment down below your favorite hot drink from anywhere, Dunkin', Starbucks, wherever. My favorite season and why? My favorite season is summer because I grew up in Jersey at the beach, so I've always just been like a summer beach girl. Dogs or cats? Um, as you see, my dog in this video. <laughs> Definitely dogs. I've only ever grown up with dogs. I've never had cats and I think I'm allergic to cats. So definitely dogs, and right now, me and my boyfriend have a puppy, so dogs it is. What is my dream vacation? My dream vacation is to go to Bali, Indonesia. How many kids do I wanna have? I used to only say two because growing up it was just me and my brother, but I think now four. Definitely not three because I always feel bad for the middle child, and I was the youngest, so like, I don't know, I feel like I don't ever want my kid to feel like a middle child. So I think four. If God blessed me with four, four. Why are you smiling? Why is <laughs> Four kids, let's get right to it. <laughs> what would my last meal be? Gosh forbid. I don't know. I like love food, so I don't know what my last meal would be. You can spend 24 hours anywhere and any year. Where would you choose? I wouldn't say anywhere in the past because I just think that's like stupid like to live in the past. So I'd probably pick a year somewhere in the future. I don't know like what year specifically, but the year that I have like my dream job, my family, and like I'm living what I want to live in the future. So whenever that comes, that's the year I'd pick to be in. If I was a ghost, who or where would I haunt? What? <laughs> if I was a ghost? Like, that's so creepy, I'm not even answering that. What is my family ancestry? So, my mom's side is Greek and my dad's side is Italian, but my yaya, like my grandma, she took an ancestry DNA test and it came up that we were Turkish and like a couple other things. I don't know, a lot of us look very different so I'm Greek and Italian but there could be other things in there what scares me like in like life is failure but like small things like I don't like being in my apartment by myself at night just because I like get scared and I check if the door is locked like 40 times so I guess it's just like small things but yeah just failure in general what am I most grateful for my family I was blessed to be raised by like really great people and I've always had a super supportive family around me so I'm most grateful for my family how do you relax after a long day I would relax by doing my night routine so if you want to see my night routine give this video a like and I will film that describe yourself in one sentence I would say that I put my all into everything that I do and I never do anything half-assed so if I'm gonna get into something like, regardless of what it is in my life, it's always gonna be 100% or I just won't do it at all. What is one thing that I like to do all the time? I like to dance. I figured that's 
probably obvious if you're watching this video you probably know that I am a dancer <laughs> what is the meaning of my name so that's kind of interesting actually because my name was supposed to be Dina and then my parents were like trying to figure out how to spell it and they were like going back and forth like D-E-A-N-A, D-I-A-N-A, like all the different ways you could spell it. And then when they spelled it D-E-A-N-N-A, -N -N -A, my dad was like, that's kind of Deanna. And then my mom was like, oh, I actually like that. So that's why my name is Deanna. <laughs> Who is one person that inspires you the most? This is going to be so cringy. <laughs> My boyfriend inspires me the most. Yep, say it louder. The quiet yeah. behavior. No, but my boyfriend really does. He like is probably the hardest working person I've ever met. So. Shout out to me. If I didn't live in this country, where would I want to live? Somewhere in Europe. What motivational quote always makes me happy? Um, this doesn't always make me happy, but it just is something that I think you should live by. And you should always be never too high and never too low. How long does it take for me to forgive someone? I feel like it depends, like, on if it's, like, my best friend, like, five seconds. Well, actually, it depends what they do. But, like, me and my best friend, like, always just argue about stupid stuff and then I'm over it. But, like, actually forgive someone, I feel like I would say I forgive you and then actually still be thinking about it for, like, ever. <laughs> Which food could always make me happy? Sushi or, like, a chocolate cake with fudge and ice cream? Am I an extrovert or an introvert? I feel like I'm an extrovert. Lies. I'm an extrovert when it comes to like being around my friends, but I'm also like extremely inverted when it comes to like my thoughts and things like personally about myself. I always usually keep to myself until like I'm like definite on what I want to do, which takes a while because I'm also like super indecisive. Where did I grow up? I grew up in New Jersey, Central Jersey. South there, Jersey. There is a thing, Central Jersey. It's where the beach is. South Jersey. If you're from North Jersey, like Nathaniel, you don't He's think. From South Jersey. I'm from Central Jersey, Ocean County. Completely South Jersey. Where do I currently live? I currently live in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. How tall am I? I'm five four. My funniest moment throughout high school, just my entire senior year, is comical to think about. What year was I born? I was born in 1999. Are you in college? Yes, I am currently a junior in college. What is my favorite drink? I would say water because that's what I drink the most. <laughs> what are my life goals? I have a lot of life goals in like different aspects of life. Like I have goals for my career. I have goals for my education. I have goals for my family. I have a lot of goals. I think I'm very goal driven. What sports do you or have you ever played? I've only ever danced, so I think that's a sport. A lot of people argue that, but I've only ever danced. I think if I played other sports, like if I was really dedicated to a different sport when I was younger, I would probably be really good at that. Do I speak any languages? And if I do, how well? If I were to have a basic Spanish conversation, I could probably do that. And I can also understand Greek. When I was in Greece for like three weeks, I was picking up on a lot of it. My family can speak it, so I just kind of understand what they're saying, but I can't really speak it. Am I single or in a relationship? She's in a relationship, people. <laughs> How long was your longest relationship? My, She's in one. My current relationship is the longest relationship. How do I describe my fashion sense? I either am wearing all of my boyfriend's clothes and... What wearing right now, my buddy? <laughs> yeah, I either look like a little boy or I'm um, like all extra dressed up. Have you ever moved from home? If so, where to and how was the experience? Yes, my freshman year I moved to California and I hated it. If you want advice, if you should move across the country, let me know because that could be a whole like 30 minute video on my experience of when I lived in California. Okay, for my last question, it says, why did I choose to do YouTube? And I kind of answered this in my last video, but I used to film YouTube and I loved when I filmed everything. I think it's awesome to have a bunch of stuff on memory and like actual footage of certain events. So I personally did YouTube or am doing YouTube more for myself, but um, also to put everything out there because I know that there's people that like to see what I'm doing. 
Okay, so that's it for the get to know me tag. If you like this video, make sure you give it a like and comment down below any video ideas that you guys want to see. Make sure you guys subscribe so you can see all of the next videos that are coming soon. Peace. Thanks, sir.